everyone at some point in their life used the handy Google Maps. However, there are some who ventured way too far into the unknown and found some pretty creepy things with Google Maps. Here are the 10 creepiest things found on Google Maps. A possible Scientology base. Scientology is a religious belief with a mix of science and the spiritual, with quite a bit of alien fanfare mixed in that we don't have time to get into right now. Whenever a Hollywood celebrity gets associated with Scientology, chances are it will be reported in the news with great coverage. What's creepy, however, is that there are a group of sites around the USA and the world supposedly believed to be real operational Scientology bases. One of such bases is the Trementina base in New Mexico, which was found on Google Maps. On the map, you'll see two parallel circles in their centers with diamond shapes in it. The strange symbol marks a secret Scientology base and is meant to guide it to outer space leaders back to Earth. While most people thought it was a facility meant to flag aliens making their way to Earth, an ex-Scientologist denied it as it would be ridiculous. The facility, according to him, actually has a sensible purpose. He explained that it is to guide other members towards the founder of Scientology, L. Ron Hubbard's works that have been written on the gold sheets and kept in titanium boxes right at the site. Sandy Island Strange things have been appearing on maps ever since we started using them because maps in the past was constantly updated with input from various explorers and cartographers. It wasn't uncommon for an unknown piece of land to show up mysteriously. Not until 2012 where we were certain that we had every inch of the Earth mapped when Google Satellite picked up a huge mysterious land mass appearing northwest of New Caledonia. It was called Sandy Island and it had a radius of that of Manhattan. However, when scientists actually sailed in the area where Sandy Island is supposed to be, they never actually found any landmass. It was open water for miles on end instead. They explained that it might be due to human error or possible pumice raft. Sandy Island appeared on Google Maps, but not on other types of maps, and since there is nothing there, Google has since removed the mysterious landmass. Interestingly enough, it may not necessarily be an error as this island has been appearing on paper maps since 1876. A whaling ship named Velocity first recorded it on their charts and we still have no idea what they saw there. Some say that it must have been a raft. Others believe that it's a magical island that only shows itself to the worthy. I guess we may never know. Giant Disfigured Bunny there is an enormous pink bunny spotted on the hills of a 5,000-foot-high Coletto Fava mountain in the Piedmont region of northern Italy. The toy lies on its back with arms open to the skies, from where it appears to have fallen. The fall must have been catastrophic because the side of the bunny is split open and its entrails of straw are spread out. It's not exactly a ghastly sight and do not make some people happy. The pink rabbit was knitted by Gelatin, a group of artists from Vienna as an outdoor sculpture for people to climb on, relax on its belly, and play with. The bunny is 200 feet long and about 20 feet thick. It is made of a soft, waterproof material and is stuffed with straw. The bunny appeared on the hills in 2005 and was originally bright pink. Now, it has turned a murky gray and is slowly rotting back into the earth. There is no removal date set for this, and it will likely stay there until it is consumed by Mother Nature or curious passing animals. The creators expected the bunny to last until 2025, although it was almost completely decomposed by 2016. Nagoro, Village of Dolls Nagoro, a town in Japan, is certainly not one to be visited by people who are afraid of dolls. Nagoro is a small village that has only a few dozen inhabitants. Despite its size, this town has become a popular tourist destination, all thanks to the hundred of non-human residents. Sukumi Ayano lived in Nagoro, but her family and her left the town when she was a child. When she moved back in the early 2000s, she faced a lifetime of loneliness, and she made a doll in the likeness of her father. And ever since then, she made hundreds of dolls to fill the void, many of which were made to look like the former residents of Nagoro. Such dolls look creepy on Google Maps, but they have made the village a popular destination for tourists. Underwater Pyramids while we're strictly against conspiracy theories, unless they're creepy or awesome, mysterious locations found on Google Maps have done their part in giving credence to many of them. One of them is the underwater pyramid found on Google Maps in the Bahamas. The discovery was celebrated by many tabloids and conspiracy lovers as evidence of aliens, Atlantis, and a wide range of other items that still remains a question. 
It was found by a conspiracy theorist in a national treasure-like hunt, which led to this amazing discovery and much later confirmed by Google Maps. Some experts believe that it may have been something built by an ancient civilization, though they also admit that there's no way to disprove that it's not a secret alien base. We'll leave that up to future explorers. Pigeon People If you discovered the streets of West Tokyo on Google Maps, you may run into a row of people just standing and looking at you. They may come across as original people just staring at the Google Street View crew out of curiosity, except all of them have their pigeon masks on. Aside from the justifiable question of where did they even get so many pigeon masks to begin with, it's all rather mysterious and unsettling. As it turns out, the pigeon people were locals who happened to know when Google would be driving by that street and decided to pull a huge prank on the world. It's all rather harmless and fun, provided you knew the explanation. Portal to Hell in New Baltimore, New York If you watched or played Silent Hill, you will get the fright of your life when you see the images of this area in Google Street View. It looks strikingly similar to the twisted buildings and shadowy figures that appeared in the Silent Hill universe. However, it was later revealed that it was a technical rendering problem that resulted in the distorted images of the entire road. While it has already been cleared, the area still feels eerie because what was seen cannot really be unseen. The Message in Memphis this next image was found on the rooftop of a Peabody Place Entertainment and Retail Center in Memphis, Tennessee. Located on top of the building is the phrase, Come downtown and play. And it does sound like something out of a horror film. Google Earth is often too distant away from the ground to allow people's browsing to mark anything strange. But this message was spray painted onto the roof so large that it's visible even from satellite images. We don't know who wrote this message or why they want people to come to play, but it's safe to say that this is not an invitation no one should be replying to. Memphis is a nice place to go and all, but keep this vacation off your travel list. El Bronx, Colombia El Bronx in Bogota, Colombia had managed to earn the reputation as one of the most hazardous places in the city before it was demolished. One of the most crime-riddled regions in the country, it certainly didn't make for a nice walk at night or any time of the day. While the area doesn't exist anymore, Google Street View crew managed to capture it on the peak of its glory. What may look like normal streets of a slum is made multiple times more terrifying if you knew that the neighborhood was recognized as child prostitution and murder. Some of those buildings also house murder victims at times, who were then fed to starving dogs as a message to rival gangs. Tough life there. Murder Victim For those who've always wondered if Google Maps has ever unintentionally recorded a serious crime, we're here to tell you that yes, it has. The case in question was a 14-year-old boy in Richmond, California, whose dead body showed up on Google Maps. It was seen with police cars and a bunch of detectives standing around, suggesting that it was taken after the body was found. Understandably, the image brought back some emotions for the victim's father, who immediately requested Google to have it removed. It was gone from their maps within days, though it does make us speculate if Google Maps still has unintended images of other serious crimes around the world. Well, you have reached the end of our list and we hope you learned something new watching this video. Tell us in the comments below which of these creepy things found on the Google Maps actually shocked you. Make sure to also subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon to get updated when we upload more cool videos like this. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.